pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. I hope you're hungry because your lunch choices for today are hamburger, popcorn, chicken, or cheese salad, or could be in a bar or a sandwich. Now over to Mr. Alejandro with more morning announcements. Good morning, Sunrise Leaders. Can you believe it, ladies, that we're at the end of our school year? It went by fast. <laughs> it went by fast? Did you guys enjoy yourselves? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, listen, I, I want, on behalf of administration, myself, Miss Kenya, um, and our whole faculty, we want to wish you guys a safe and happy summer. A couple recommendations for you ladies and for the rest of your classmates out there is make sure that when you, if you go to the beach, um, swim near a lifeguard tower, drink plenty of water, use sunscreen. Um, uh, you will be hearing me message, and you'll have another Sunday Connect coming up where we message about taking on the superintendent's challenge, uh, the reading and math challenge out there, and I'll be explaining that a little bit later. But um, we're so proud of the year that you've had. Um, you've, you guys have been involved in the seven habits and many more things. Um, some of you guys have been involved in intramural sports. I have Greta here who was involved in various intramural sports. What do you think about intramural sports this year? It was super fun. What was fun about it? Um, we got to play lots of games and we had some championships. Yep, we had some championships and then you got a shirt out of it. Can we look at your shirt real quick? It's a flag football shirt. Maybe you guys can see. Um, next year, we plan on having a, a, a more ambitious uh, schedule for sports. We're going to be bringing a kickball league. Of course, we'll continue football. We'll continue soccer. We're going to have volleyball. Um, and we're also going to do some uh, different sports, um, like ultimate frisbee. Um, that's just going to be some of the great that's going to continue to happen. But the more important piece is that we're going to continue to bring some uh, awesome academics and curriculum toward for you guys um, from your teachers. So, you know, during the summer, make sure that you do sharpen the saw, but take time to be proactive during the summer. You know, take that time off, but I would say um, somewhere in the month of July, at the end of July, make sure that you guys are reading and you guys are writing and that you guys are working on some of those uh, skills that you guys know you need to work on. Anyhow, ladies, anything uh, for your, your peers you guys want to say? Hate to put you on the spot. Anything you want to say to your peers? Like happy summer? Swim well? Have a good summer. Have a good summer. Anyhow, listen, we're so proud of you guys. Have a great summer. Now back to our awesome anchors. The habit of the week is having a good vibe. Seek first to understand, then to be understood. Take the time to listen with your heart and respect others' point of view. The quote of the week is, the greatest sign of success for a teacher is to be able to say, the children are now working as if I did not exist. Now over to Mr. Robinson. Good morning, everyone, and happy last day of school here at Sunrise Elementary. Uh, the Sunrise Chess Club has been a chess club that we've been, uh, Ms. Townsend and I have been operating now for the last two years. We're just finishing up our second year and going into our third year. This year we had 43 active participants, uh, and that is a great number for us. Next year, we're hoping to get up to 50. We're hoping also next year to begin our virtual chess club by allowing by allowing our chess club members uh, the opportunity to play against other uh, chess club players in other schools and or other districts. So we'll see how we can get that program going this summer. Right now we'd like to announce our chess club winners. We had our chess club tournament that concluded yesterday and our runner-up is Miss Greta Carlson. Greta, oh, we're on <laughs> Greta, congratulations to you. Thank you. And we have here a trophy that's going to be engraved for you. A trophy. And the gift bag with some goodies in it. But one of the things I'm most encouraged by is this little tag here that says Inspire. And you are a fantastic chess club player this year. So you Thank inspire you. us to continue to play. And then our chess club champion is Miss Allison Floser. Congratulations to Allison. And you have a trophy also. And Allison gets a lunch pail. Inside this pail, there are some goodies. But there's also a $25 Google gift card for you 
to enjoy because Allison came almost every day to our chess club meetings and she excelled at it. So congratulations to you, Allison. And thank you, thank you everyone. Have a fantastic summer. Wow, today is our last day as fifth graders and the last day of school. I'm, I'm going to miss, miss these times. So, so many wonderful memories. Yes, like the time when Mrs. Scorpio cried during our graduation ceremony and thanked our parents. We will miss our loving teachers. Thank you. And I'll never forget all the awesome field trips I went to throughout the year. Thank you, teacher. I've enjoyed participating in these tours, especially all the funny bloopers. Right, Analia? <laughs> <laughs> I enjoyed watching Tuck Everlasting. Now for the end of the year video.